I'm Brian Gardner. I'm the president and CEO of Microtech Systems and also Level 4 Telecom. And because of our two businesses um, under one umbrella, we have a wide skill set of employees that we need from network engineers to system managers. Um, we cover a wide range of um, disciplines that we need to be able to cover from you know, basic network troubleshooting and network repair and design to how computer networks affect phone quality and voice quality under level four. We have the voice side of our business and with the IT side, um, they can really lean on one, one another. Um, this also gives our employees um, more career paths because they can start in one side of the business and they can grow and migrate and possibly from one side to the other. So I've always been interested in technology. Um, I kind of grew up at that weird age where computers just started coming out. So I got lucky. I started in finance here um, and just kind of worked my way up. And there was a positioning for a telecom engineer. And I showed Brian that I was interested. And he put me in the position and see what I could do. Um, and then Career Source Research Coast started the apprenticeship program, which I'm really grateful for because it allowed me the opportunity to get my A plus certification. Now I understand to why I do use certain protocols and all the other fancy smancy terms that they throw at you. And I understand what I'm actually doing now, not just kind of doing it. <laughs> so for somebody looking to get into IT, I would recommend definitely make sure you're passionate about it because if you're not passionate about it, it's not gonna be fun. Um, definitely something you love and that you care about because it can be pretty grueling. <laughs> so you have to be passionate about technology. You have to make sure you have that care. And as soon as you have that, it kind of just starts flowing to you naturally. The apprenticeship program I participated in was with CareerSource and I got involved with it through my employer and the program I was with is the uh, network specialist. The advice I give to other young professionals entering the apprenticeship program would be to do it. Why not? Set time aside and do it. It would only benefit you to do it. And um, I can't really think of a reason why not to do it. It adds more uh, knowledge and skills to your career and it just would help. I can't see why it would hurt. Some of the challenges I experienced in the program was not knowing what I didn't know. So that's the whole purpose of why I went there, to learn what I didn't know and to fine tune my skills. So some of the challenges that, uh, I, that approached me was essentially learning something I didn't know. But uh, it was good though because I had an uh, um, well-versed instructor who was prepared to answer any questions that any of us threw at, threw at him. So knowledge was there at our fingertips. I would absolutely recommend uh, an apprenticeship as a career path for anyone. Um, you would just you gain more knowledge than when you started and it would add, add um, certifications, knowledge, skills to make you more enticing to employers. If you're looking for a job or if you currently have a job, it just makes you more valuable to your current employer. It helps you get a better understanding of the big picture diagnosing uh, issues that might come across you and give you a better understanding of what you're expected of you in the field. My dream project is I just like to tinker. Right now at home, I, um, my project currently in front of me is building an electric skateboard. Um, so I also magnet fish as a hobby, so I want to build <laughs> I want to build a little submarine, submersible, so I can go underneath and see what I'm actually magnet fishing for. So my end game goal is just to tinker, to tinker around, just like to build. Both staff really benefited because they were able to sharpen skills and earn certifications that they normally would not have been able to do or less likely been able to do on their own. Um, so being able to run them through the program both made them focus on their own professional development and also sharpening their skill set, which makes them ultimately more valuable to us because then we have people that are, are growing, not just stagnant.